Hey, good evening, everybody. Hope you're all having a lovely evening. Just making sure everything is good. I think we can switch over to the main game so long. Everything seems to be in place. Okay, I can see everything that I need to, everything is good to go, and we can officially start off this run. So, welcome everybody, I hope you're all having a lovely day and all night, depending on where you're from. Welcome to the stream, and tonight we're going to be running some Risk of Rain 2. Now, we finished off actually getting all the characters that we needed. So we've got all the characters. So we'll probably start fucking around with some of them tonight, probably going to try some monsoon run, see if we can't potentially start getting the alternate skins for a lot of these classes because in order to get the alternate skin you have to beat the game or obliterate yourself on monsoon difficulty so i think that's what we're going to be going for is the obliteration because i'm not in the mood to fight uh, matrix every single time so fuck that noise um so before we climb into it just to let everybody know we do have a new target of 50 followers please help me reach that goal However you can, reach out to friends, reach out to family, share it on your social media, share it amongst discords that you are part of, shout it out to other random streamers. However you can, get the word out there. I really would appreciate it. We're trying to grow the channel, trying to bring more content to you. I'm streaming basically every single night, putting in the time, putting in the effort. Let's help it means something now for those of you that don't know all of my past live streams do get posted onto a YouTube channel for your viewing pleasure in case you ended up missing a stream. So go show some love. Go subscribe, go and turn on your notifications over there. That way, if you did miss a stream, you'll be notified of when an upload is and you can catch up at your own time. Also, we now have a Discord. The Discord is there for you to be part of a community outside of just the streams. So if you want a place to go and chat, to go and communicate, or to also get notifications on when I'm going live, or to catch up on past live streams, or just to connect with the community, Discord is now there as well. So... You're more than welcome to go join the Discord. The link is in the bottom of this uh, this stream. Now, further ado, we need to figure out who we're actually going to be running first. Do we just run it down the list? Or are we going to think about... And then, how do we want to do this? Do we want to do this monsoon difficulty with artifacts? And then, what type of artifacts are we going to run? Or do we want to just do a couple of bland runs now there are still a couple of things that i need to unlock which is bugging me a little bit because i'm not 100 percent sure how to unlock them and one of them that i really really want is the four leaf clover and then there's a whole bunch of stuff that i've never had so you know what screw it we're just gonna go for some good runs so I think let's let's grab the new guy. I haven't played with this guy that much. We'll do normal runs. And actually let's do easy runs. And we're not going to turn on artifact command. We are however going to spawn doubles. Blue Blash 25. Hello. How are you this evening? Or day. Don't know where you're from. Doing good, I'm glad to hear that. Um, I think let's go double. This way I can guarantee that there's going to be more. We're not going to go artifact command. We're not going to go artifact again. And depending on what we look like, we might get the artifact of all enemies or elites. But I'll have to look up what the code for that is again. So I think that's it. Don't think I've played with the captain so much, so... Let's figure out how the captain runs.
Okay, so what do we got? Okay. Okay, some attack speed can definitely benefit from this. Okay, we've got a 3D printer over there. Hey JJ, how you doing this evening, man? Welcome. What the fuck was that? What is it like an orbital strike? Not too bad, thanks. I'm doing good. Hope you've had a good weekend. Did you work most of the weekend? I missed you. You weren't here for a couple of the streams, so I was wondering where you at. Well, that's not a bad thing to pick up first. Missile launcher. Okay. Was at least a good weekend. At least get some good work in. What the fuck does this thing do? Sorry, I'm playing a character that I have like never really put in any time and effort into in the past, so I'm trying to learn what the hell this guy does. Was alright, nothing special. <laughs> you missed all of my Hull Diver stream. Yeah, I finally went and bought Hull Divers. I succumbed to peer pressure. But you only place one per stage. Oh, okay. So, okay, that's gonna be nice. So, because I am basically doing um, enemy drops instead of chests, I can just drop that at the teleporter. That's nice. Okay, well, that's beneficial to know. Thank you very much. Appreciate that. Banners. Oh shit, okay. Oh, okay, I see what you mean by this left mouse button and a right mouse button option. Okay, that's pretty cool. Is there a way that we can influence the radius of the stun of this uh, tower? Does that scale with anything? Or does it scale with level? No, sadly. Oh, that sucks. That would have been nice if we could actually increase that. Now, this is unfortunately the side effect of doing the artifact, where we don't have chests. Is that I could potentially run around for quite a bit before I actually start getting drops. I mean, how many things have I killed? And there's still nothing being dropped. So I think this fight is going to be interesting. It's very useful though, because only a set number of enemies spawn per stage. And all that are getting stunned. Oh, that's okay. That is actually pretty cool. It's useful, but I can see its effectiveness running dry come later stages. Okay, 
Yeah, we got a banner. I'm not too irritated with the banner. I'm already approaching the six minute mark. I'm supposed to be trying to get out of here as soon as possible. I've already got a banner, so there's no point in trading in my banner for a banner. Hmm. Depending on what boss I get, the boss fight could be interesting. If I get the beetle coin, the orbital strikes might be nice. But if I get the jellyfish, I'm going to be pretty fucked. Uh, we're approaching six minutes. I'm going to wait for one more enemy wave to spawn. And then... See if anything drops. Well, I did technically want something to spawn, but a medkit was definitely not what I wanted. <laughs> Let's start the fight and see what I get. It's going to be double bosses, so Beetle Queen, Beetle Queen, Beetle Queen. Stone Titan. You know what? I can live with that. Okay, he's dead. You know what? That actually went a lot smoother than what I thought it was going to. Uh, what is this? Uh, boost health and regeneration. You know what? That's not bad, especially with what I got already. JJ, give me quick feedback. What's the sound looking like? Am I loud enough when the game is not overpowering? Or does the game need to be a bit quieter? Or does the game need to be a bit louder? Damage to enemies close by. Not bad. You're all good, yeah. Awesome. Thanks, brother. Thank you. Appreciate it, both of you. Nothing else for me that I missed anyway. Nope. Okay. Let's bounce. Eight minutes. Eh, it's not too bad. It's about a minute off longer than what I wanted to be here, but yeah, it's okay. Hey, Blue Bash, I thank you for the follow. I really appreciate that. Did the... Hold on. Did the animation actually play when you followed on screen? I missed it completely. And I didn't get the audio notification. Yeah, the animation played. Lovely. Thanks for the follow, man. I really appreciate it. I was a bit slow on realizing that. Okay, found the teleporter. What's your main character? Railgunner. 100% Railgunner. I'm pretty fucking decent with the sniping, hitting those crits every single time, that coupled with a couple of glasses and the watches, that damage is god tier. And speaking of which, I'm gonna sacrifice one, that's perfect. Sacrifice, you know, the banner getting it up, that's fine. Two glasses, nice and early, I can live with it. What's your mind? Right now, Engineer. Engineer is, has always and will always be OP. It's one of those amazing classes that you can do it right and you're lucky with your... Um, especially if you're playing without the Artifact of Command. 
it it stacks so nicely, specifically because all of your toads inherit. Try to have to focus there for a moment, especially because your turrets inherit everything that you pick up. The engineer is freaking insane. If you get the fungus, but the um, the alternate to the fungus, the one where it actually heals you when you sprint instead of healing you when you're standing still, it becomes so nice, especially when you get the yeah, especially when you use the moving turrets. That's the lasers, right? That's not the actual turrets. It's the laser. Yeah, the one with the lasers. Yeah. Yeah, the moving turret is nice. I prefer the, the standing still. The stationary turrets. That's just because I like to play with the enemies drop the items instead of the chests. Oh, that's nice. Guillotine. Instantly kills uh, low health elite monsters. No ways. Did I really just get that? <laughs> Isn't that like a 1 in 25 chance of dropping? <laughs> oh, that is insane. That's a ridiculously low chance of that dropping. The pearls. Oh, that's gorgeous. Now all I need is a ukulele. A ukulele now would be absolutely amazing. Do void items drop or do you have to collect them? No, 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 I have to collect them. So I will still need to find a fashion. So I can go over there and clean out the area. And probably get a void item in there. It's just right now I don't want to risk it. And I'm still a bit squishy at this point. Guillotine yeah, doing its work. Oh. What would be nice right now is a gasoline in conjunction with the ignite bottle. What's that ignite bottle's name? You know what? Let's start this fight. What am I looking like? What are we fighting? Fuck. Not what I wanted. Run, 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 run. That's gonna hurt. I made it just, just out. Okay. GG. What did it give me? You know what? I can deal with that. Squid turrets. That's nice. And it still needs something that's going to spread the damage to others. Guillotine, Will of the Wisp. Ukulele would be nice. Are you going for Matrix? No, going for Obliteration. I don't like the Matrix fight. I do it once to get the character, and then I basically never do it again. Another pair of glasses. That's four glasses now. We're up to 40%. Yeah, early on, they're not bad. Early on, just having that little bit of extra firepower helps. It's definitely no engineer turret. Oh, GG.
Okay, we've started to gain some movement speed. You're going for obliteration? Yes, that's my goal. Going for obliteration? I don't like the Mystrix fight, so... Stage 8 or stage 7 or 8? It's one of those two. Um, there's a scrapper over here, that's nice. Oh, those watches. Those are watches. Okay. Yo, hells yes. Oh, hells yes. Scrapping the turrets and scrapping the elixir bottle. I don't think the elixir bottle is worth it. So I'm going to scrap that. I need to scrap something, and I'll scrap that instead then, because I want one of these watches. The damage output is... Oh, great. Um... Thank you. Whoa, sorry. Uh, no, don't quite understand the question. What does that special do for that? The equipment. You talking about R? Or you talking about the uh, pearl? Q. Oh, Q doesn't do anything. That's just my... Um, the... Basically can't press it. That's just representing that I've got the pearl. Absolutely nothing. If I tap it, it does nothing. Uh, where is the portal? Crowbar, nice. Uh, portal. Where's the portal? Did I run past the portal? Stun, not interested. Oh no, that's not a stun, that's a sec. Okay. Uh, portal. I don't see the. Is it up there? No, it's over there. I see the particles. So, JJ, what are you up to this evening, brother? I'm so slow. Oh, nice. I <laughs> just talking about being slow. Chilling was working earlier. Did I at least have an earlier night or did you have another late night? Teleporter must be up there. Yeah. 
Sticky bombs, nice. What are we? What are we? Probably gonna be a big imp. Oh no, actually clay. Absolutely wrecked. That's nice. That is exactly what I wanted. That means the burn effect that this supplies is gonna be like four times. Hopu feather. I'm not sure Hopu works cool. That's gonna be nice. Okay, now it means that burn that I do with this pearl is gonna do extra damage. Damage while healing, that's nice. Sorry, heal while doing damage. Not looking bad, not looking too bad. I have done more with less and less with more. Go. Yeah, we're good to go. Let's get out of here. Yes, I have. I actually was talking about it at the beginning of the stream. I'm like, I actually need to start doing the monsoon runs again. So when I started um, streaming like 30 days ago, um, I completely wiped my account completely from scratch. So I had to start everything over from the beginning. And one of the things that I was mentioning now when I started today's stream was I needed to get to the monsoon runs again so that I can actually... Um, start getting these skins for all the characters again I have not completed monsoon with every single character I think the only character in the past that I completed monsoon with was commander um, huntress um, railgunner and engineer I haven't done monsoon with any of the other characters I will not be doing an artifact of the mountain. I am not stupid. The payout might be nice. Eh, what's the worst that's going to happen? Yeah, so depending on how the night goes, I'll probably, I normally end up starting with an easy run. Get myself flowing again, get myself feeling good. And then I might switch over to a monsoon run. Then I cry. Ooh, there's a free. Did I kill something that I didn't know about? Some free glasses over here. And some free feathers. What died? Fireworks and another. Wait, what's my crit at? Oh, I'm at a 50% chance crit, so basically one in every second. Okay, we've got some fungus over there. That's uh, th This might actually be big. Depending on what we get from these, I might get my damage while moving. Sort it out nice and early. Let's grab this. How are we looking? That's all the monsters dealt with. Area is clear. Okay. 
Gasoline. Gas of fucking lean. Thank you. Now we're going to start getting AoE damage. Nice. Let's see what I get. What did you give me? Nope. Don't want that. That's for the ATGs. Nice. Yeah, gasoline right now is going to be big. Two more gasolines would be nice. I normally cap it out at three. Does it? Won't I benefit more from norm? Uh, I suppose I do automatically gain one then. Fuck it. Let's take it. Fire missiles on every hit. While you have shield. Yeah, it was stupid of me not to take that. GG, thanks. Good call. See, there's another one over there, so I might just as well grab it. See what it does for me. Stay out of those circles. I got the health for it, so let's find out what you got for me. Ah, uh, needle. Do I want needle? See, I'm not too good with the void items. That good for Captain. Sweet. Ah. Oh, great. Well, that was on purpose. Anybody asks, I did that completely planned. That was completely planned as well. I did not mean to be on the other side of the map. <laughs> I'm dealing with your guys. You should fuck that. But... Yeah, that's why um, you'll see that the two uh, printers that there were for uh, bleed. I said, fuck it. I didn't even bother. Wrong character. Yeah, with Captain, I'm trying to stack the crowbars and the crits. What did we drop? Another one. Oh, I'm going to get two kick packages. Okay, let's hit this. Should be good to go. What am I fighting? I'm missing a pot. Probably downstairs. Well, I think my equipment gives me a burst of speed. That helps me nothing. Approach is nice. Don't fall. That's nice. That's nice. Equipment charge, once again, completely useless. For me right now, at least. That ATG, though. <laughs> Dude, this ATG is doing sick work. Like, massive call on that. The fact that it, as long as I've got, yeah. Looking like this might be a good run. Give me a second. I want to see if I can't get the uh, artifact codes. 
Let's go rain. I want that one. No, is it this one? No, it's not that one. I need. Is it this one? Uh, okay, I need the one that is not glass. I don't like glass. Kin. No, I've got kin already. Metamorphosis. Metamorphosis. Fuck now. Um. Wisps emerge from defeat enemies now. Exploding bombs, no. Ranger's doppelganger, no. Which one is the one that's going to give me elites only? Can only spawn as elites. Artifact of honor. Okay, got the code. Uh, square, 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 triangle, square, 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 square. Well, that's pretty easy. Everything is square except for the center one. Okay, well, now that I know that, I can at least minimize that. So everything is square except for the middle one. It's a triangle. Got you. That's there. That's there. I uh, bring this back up. I right, got everything back up on my screen. Nah, I get it. I just, I do not have the time or patience to try and find out where they are. Well, technically, well, we could, look, look there. We could say I didn't bullshit. There it is right there. Square, 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 square. <laughs> Triangle in the center. I found it. <laughs> <laughs> what are the chances? Okay. Legit, I found it. Here we go. Happy? <laughs> you see, I believe this artifact is nice because especially if you're running double enemies, um, half the health, You just set the pep. Yeah, literally. That's the exact password that I just set. Squares all around and triangle in the center. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. How lucky was that? Oh, well. I missed the platform. There's a good chance I die right now. Okay, already got the next one. That's nice. Get out of it. Fuck. I keep running into it. Well, of the wisp. That's nice. I think I've got two of them now. Let's get in there as quickly as I can. Yeah, at the chances, it could not have, at the time, it could not have been more perfect. Oh, but as I was saying, um, this artifact with double enemies, half the health, um, makes the cash flow very, very nice. I swear I picked up two. But apparently you can't carry two at a time. Another gasoline. That's going to be massive. Okay, I can't really read chat right now. a key that's useless but I do see a crowbar over here Elder Lemurian that's not very nice of you I'm gonna die Ooh, that's possibly gonna kill me don't die 
I took no damage. Can someone explain why? Okay. Damn it, I need to stop running into it. Uh, well, lately I've been streaming Helldivers 2 along with Risk of Rain. I've been playing some Borderlands as well, and then I love Path of Exile. So the game I was streaming when I started was Path of Exile. And then I've done like one or two random games in between. But the two games I'm going to be focusing on right now is Risk of Rain, Path of Exile. And then there is one other game that I want to start basically end of the month. And depends on if it comes out at the end of the month. If it doesn't, then it's going to be Robin Hood. Watch Portal XL. Wait, where are we reading Portal XL? game that I just listed. Oh, Path of Exile. Uh, uh, think Diablo, but better. Yeah, Path of Exile. Think Diablo, but actually good. Um, no, um, that's all good, man. Um, yeah, think Diablo, but no pay-to-win bullshit, and actually decent. With a skill tree that'll give you a headache, and yeah. It's phenomenal. It's called Path of Exile. Is the game a bit um, loud? Do you want me to turn it down a bit? So you can actually hear me better. Let me do this. Just turn my... Okay, I've turned the game down a bit, so you should be able to hear me better. <laughs> yeah, no, sorry. It's Path. Am I just getting very unlucky in this trial because the yellow key ain't spawning? Something has to be wrong, yeah. Yeah. Last time this happened to me, I literally had to just keep killing things, keep killing things, and eventually it spawned. But the nice thing is, is the moment it eventually did spawn again, like three of them spawned right after each other. Ooh, that hurt. Okay, there's another firecracker, Aldelamarian. Elite Aldelamarian. Ow, 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 ow. Thank you. There we go, got one. And the fireworks. Did I just jump off? Yeah, I jumped off the edge and it goes off my health. Okay, I need two more, I think. I think it's two more. Yeah, it's two more. I'm not gonna bother with that. Definitely not sacrificing any of my white items for that. Hmm. 
Nothing spawned up there. Like, I wouldn't mind being in here this long if the enemies I was killing kept giving me shit. But I mean, they're like, not if, oh, there's another wax coil. Um, how am I gonna get up there? My fat ass can't jump that high. I don't have a opu feather. Seriously? How long have I been here? Like, I've only got like 5,800 coins. Like, I've been here a good while. Ukulele. Okay. Run's done. I've got a ukulele, I've got a Will of the Wisp. We are looking very good. Unless I jump off. Something dropped. There we go. There's the next one. One more time. Oh, there we go. Nice and quickly. Straight off one and off another. There's a flag. I'll take that. Okay, trial complete. Trial of Honor. And then I jump off the edge again, you know, just because apparently that's something I like doing. Only thing I'm missing now to round this off. Is some hoofs. Some movement speed would be very nice. Okay, I'm gonna find the teleport and we're gonna start setting up because I haven't barely used my R ability. No, guillotine. I guess I've got a couple of those things that I could sacrifice if I really want to. I have... I've actually been thinking, like, at some point... Because a lot of the people that have been watching me don't really know Risk of Rain. Because I've got a very small community. So I was thinking Risk of Rain for a couple of videos. And then probably download something like Goku or play as an Elder Lemurian or... Something like that. But modern runs can get a lot of fun. Oh, a cup of coffee in bed. I 
I think for shits and giggles, I even once did the run where I could choose how many items I start with. And also when something does drop, how many of those items I get. So I've done like stupid runs that like every time I picked up one um, pair of glasses, it would give me like four. That's a third gasoline. Okay, we're good. Uh, where's the teleporter? Look for the particles. I don't see the particles. It's either behind that or it's behind that. But I am thinking about doing the Goku mod. Because it is pretty cool, especially when you start going through the Super Saiyans. Yeah. Some of them are a bit scuffed though. Like some of them are really shitty. They don't really work very well. But some of them are just really well done. Yeah, so I have played as Huntress now. I have... Attack speed is kind of pointless for me. I've played as Huntress. I've played as... Um, Commander. I've played as... A couple of things. Just for the viewers to get used to what Risk Rain actually is. It probably is not going to be too long before I start moving to modded runs. That is the plan at least. Because modded runs just make it interesting. Especially when you see a character do something that... You don't expect the character to do. That's not bad. There we go. DSG. And another crowbar. Okay, damage is starting to go up. And I found the teleporter as well. We're looking good, we're looking good, we're looking good. I did not miss my shots. A nice little bit of healing is always a win. Something dropped. Ah, kind of pointless for me. Oh, never mind. It's completely the wrong item. I thought it was gang gold. that Mistake for some health, and I think I picked up. Did I pick up the syringe? Yes, I've gotten a little bit of attack speed boost. And then, yeah, killing an enemy up to. I think it's one per stack. Or is it two per stack? I can't remember what the stack was on that. One per stack, yeah, I thought so. And I know that if you're playing on, I think it's. Um, if you're playing on glass cannon, it's 0 0.01 per stack. Because obviously they don't want you to negate the point of...
Funny enough, now that I come to think about it, I haven't even fought the special boss that's through that door. I need to grab the engineer and go put the... I did? Where did I miss one? Oh, there. Well, thank you very much for that, good sir. The body was covering it. All right, let's go find the... There's another tri-tip. How many daggers are we up to now? Uh, four. Okay, let's ignore everything else over here. Let's go find the teleporter and let's at least start moving on first. Now we're looking good. Stage seven, stage eight. We should be able to obliterate soon. I want the money just so I can get this. Wait, is this the... I keep forgetting, is this the download the environment data? Yes, thank you. Engineer with void ATG is OP, yeah. Engineer in general is OP. Engineer with the artifact of command is God. You're unbeaten. Uh, are we going to do it? Yeah or no? We're going to obliterate soon, so there's really no point to it, right? No, all right, sweet. Let's dump it. That's all dealt with. Teddy bear, that's big. I'll do this while I'm here. Why not? Don't need it, but it's there. Some more healing. That gasoline came in clutch. Obviously the biggest thing that made this run OP was the finding of the pearl. One more run. Yes, but that's my main games for now. Path of Excel and Risk of Rain too.
So I'm not specializing in anything. I am basically playing whatever I feel like at the time. I don't have a community big enough yet to be able to really put out a poll as to what's going to be best for me or what the community wants to see. So right now I'm just playing what I want to basically and then taking it from there. Damn, that was close. Hey, Maestro, how are you doing this evening, brother? Hope you're doing well. Yeah, so, uh, Blue, Maestro that just joined the chat, he is my resident expert for Risk of Rain. Oh, not Risk of Rain, um, Path of Exile. He's the gentleman that basically guides me into some of the most insane builds for Path of Exile. Just came home from work. How was your day, brother? It's a late night for you. Hey, Judge, you're still in chat. How are you doing, man? <laughs> You've been quiet. Never played Path of Exile. It's, it's got a curb and a half to get into. But when it works, you can really feel OP. Like, it really is a lot of fun. I'm definitely not grabbing that. Nice, another ATG. Another ATG. Got three. Everything just popped on the screen. Mag. Steak. Roach. Another firework. Uh, enemy slow when hit. Yeah, I think so. As I can never remember if it's stage 8 or stage 9. I think I'm basically at that point where I'm comfortable that... Anything from here will just be more progress. Yep, yeah, it's there. All the healing orbs that are dropping. Obliteration is done. GG. No, wrong way. That portal. Always go to the... Mm. There isn't there supposed to be a... Okay. <laughs> I've had smarter moments. Don't fall to your death. 
And the sad thing is, that's actually a real possibility. And I have done it. I have fucked around before by like, dying over here. Oh, and uh, blue. Just to make sure that you're happy. There we go. I found another one of them. <laughs> that way I can Google another one and be and cancel each other out. How does that sound? <laughs> I think it's one of the simple ones. I think that's actually the artifact of, uh, artifact of command. Hold on. Let me double check quickly. Uh, square, 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 square. I think it might actually be command. Uh, all squares. So those are all diamonds, right? That's the artifact of glass. 500% damage, but you have 10% 10, 10 health. Not bad. Trial of Honor is done. Abandoned Aqueduct. Run wasn't too bad. What is the damage like? 896,000. Not too bad. There we go. Artifact the Swarm. Monsters drop. And monsters can own it. Okay, so now we can do that. Let's remove the double. Let's remove the monsters drop from items and let's just have the enemy spawn as elites. And let's do a monsoon run. Um, I want to run my engineer. I love my engineer. Sorry, rail gunner, not engineer. Monster difficulty, artifact of honor. And I can either make this very easy for myself and take artifact of command, or we can make it very hard for ourselves and literally just run elites. What are we feeling? Really easy or really hard? Yeah. The benefit of that is the cash flow is going to be decent. The cash income is going to be very, very nice. But yeah, they're going to hit like absolute bricks. Or we can just do a clean run with absolutely nothing active. On Monsoon. See how we do. What are we feeling? Clean run. Okay. Sounds good. Let's run rail gunner then. I don't want any of those. I'm not wasting my money on that cash right now. I am not going to be stupid. I am not grabbing that right now. Well, that's a nice one to start off with.
Don't die. Thank you. <laughs> I love the rail gunner. It works so well. The uh, weak point is so forgiving. Really, really so forgiving. So I'm going to run around and grab one or two more. One or two more normal chests. Uh, because I did see there was a big chest further back there. So I want to see if I can't maybe get lucky and get a red item from it. But a green item would be nice. You know what? That's not too bad if we can get the ult for that. There's another big chest over there, which is nice. Green item. ATG. Nice. Nice start. Yeah, I'm going to do one loop around the back of the map. And then I'll come back this way. This is what I wanted. Yeah, that's fine. Um, I'm going to sacrifice it. It's fine. For this build, that's more important. Okay, let's go start the event. And that is why I love the Railgunner so much. And you got wall hacks with the rail gunner, which is also nice. What am I getting? What am I getting? What am I getting? I could have done with better than that, but I can live with that. Okay, we're looking good. Here's something up there.
Let's get out of here. Not too bad. Not too bad first round. <laughs> what are we looking at? Stun? No. That might be nice. Some shield. Chest. Okay, now we wait for shit to spawn. Three in one. That was a nice hit. That was a very, very nice hit. Uh, what are the cost of the chests? Chest of 73. That's just 73. Okay. A little bit more cash. It works, especially for the normal fire. One shot. I'm one short. There's cash over there. Teddy bear. Teddy bear is nice. I can live with the teddy bear. <laughs> Blue, can you now see why I enjoy the real gunner so much? Scrapper. Uh, is there anything I want to scrap? I don't think so. There is a hoof. Attack speed, which is nice. And then... Oh, no, without a doubt, a hoof first. That movement speed is going to come in clutch. There's a scrapper that I don't need right now because I've got nothing that I really, really want to scrap. I must have reload. Nice. I got the cash, I'm just not seeing any chests. that oh well, yeah that works oh my god come on please tell me you just saw what I picked up now if you're not sure what I just picked up Gain 100% critical strike chance for 8 seconds. 
that combined with the fact that the sniper if I hit with that it automatically does critical the damage I'd put on that should be insane banner you know, I think that's good enough for now oh wait I see a chest Okay, let's go towards the teleporter and let's start the next round. Oh wait, hold on, I see a... I see a shrine, I can do this, I've got the cash for it. Nice. i got the cash, i got the cash. Please don't use all my money and give me nothing. Luna coin, not bad. Still can't use you. That thing just stole my fucking money and gave me nothing. I need, okay, I got enough. There we go. Gave me something. You know what? That's fine. More damage against bosses. I can live with that. Let's get towards the teleporter. I've wasted enough time here. Yeah. I'm in round two and I'm already on 13 minutes. I'm on the border of where I should be. JJ, you still watching or you left believing? Maestro, you head to bed, or are you still there, brother? I know you had a long day, but you're at least relaxing a little bit, playing something, or are you just chilling? Who is still in chat? I see there's three people watching. Well, I'm one of them. I'm on PoE crafting. Nice. What you building? What is the next build that you are running for? Are you crafting for somebody or are you crafting for yourself? For someone. Ooh, what you building for them?
Oh my god, I just made it with the skin on my teeth. Something like a... Stun... Not great, not good, not horrible. Something like a... Yeah, what is it? Uh, gasoline right now would be nice. I'm hitting hard, but I've got no way of sp spreading that damage to anybody. Damage is good, the critical chance is getting even better. Oh yeah, I made it out just in time. Okay, I know where the portal is. I need some shit. Please be red, please be red, please be red. Chances are highly, but please be red. You're red. Oh my god, you're red. Well, that's better than nothing. I need chests. I'm seriously running low on chests. I'm really on insane difficulty and I'm barely fucking around here yet. Come on. Make my life easy. Another one of the flags does not make my life easy. No hope of feathers, no movement. Okay, I got one poof. That's better than nothing. Attack speed might be good. Watch. Thank you. This is going to be very nice for me. Get my fat ass up this hill. Wow, I've got more than one queen. What did I miss? Uh, yes, it is. It's 100% free. For the first, like, 400 hours in the game, you will not have to spend a single cent. The only time you really have to spend any money is if you want stash tabs or cosmetics. But no, the game is 100% free. I'm gonna die. Run, 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 run.
Okay, boss is dead. Now to deal with everything else that came out of her. Oh my god, Blue, I'm busy suffering over here. I'm suffering hard. Problem, I have got no AoE damage at all. I think I got that under control relatively decently. I don't I haven't been able to find a scrapper yet. And the glasses are kind of important. A question are we doing the the boss fight for the free rare or are we gonna skip that instead because i feel like i'm gonna get fucked if i do that main box of enemies it's automatic critical shot True, but um, that's not the only thing I'm relying on. That's for single target. I still use the normal free fire quite a bit if there's quite a lot of enemies around me. go for the free raid off the boss true just my damage at the moment is a bit lackluster the crits obviously hit like a boss I am on the back foot right now. I am running around like a mad person. Hey, aliens. Wait, wait, how do I pronounce your name? I saw that you followed me, so thank you very much for that. I appreciate it. 
I think he followed like two or three days ago. I just never had the chance to say thank you. Chests. I need chests. Oh, oh, screw you. Completely unnecessary for you to be here already. I sacrifice it. Yep, what did I give up? Attack speed, that's fine. Thank you. We guys did. Okay, how are we looking? I got a fuck ton of cash and now we to spend it. Okay, let's do something stupid. Uh, equipment drone, go for it. Uh, turret, go for it. We're gonna try and get that crit, that red. Where's the other one? Normally it's over there somewhere. Can't I see it from this angle now? Okay, I am missing eggs. Okay, we're going down here. Please don't die. Please don't die. Please don't die. Yeah, we're good. Where am I missing the last egg? Hey, isn't it up here somewhere? I'm wasting so much time. I'm only on stage four. This might have been a fail. That's okay. Can't win them all. And I'm burning. I think I see the last eggs. I think I saw the last eggs. That'd be very nice.
Oh, I'm fucking around for too long. Start the main fight. We'll come back and see if we can't do the other boss afterwards. And right, I'm dead. Why is there two of them? Well, GG. We can always make our life very very easy and just turn on artifact command and then i can guarantee you we'll almost get this every single time but we don't want to do that but while you're busy with that give me two seconds i'm going to check one or two things jj thank you very much for liking my post i appreciate it And ladies and gents, it looks like we actually we actually picked up some momentum again. I think I was mentioning just the other day, JJ, that we'd come to a bit of a standstill where the followers had slowed down quite a bit. But in the last five days, we've had three additional followers. Flavor Dave, Alienice, or Alienice, I don't know how to pronounce your name, sorry brother, and then Blue Basher. Pick up some momentum again. That's quite nice. Now, for those that are new to the stream and don't know, um, all of my live streams do get posted onto my YouTube channel. So if you do miss a live stream, you can obviously catch up and go watch some live streams that you weren't a part of. Um, and then we do have a Discord as well. So if you want to join the Discord, you want to be part of a community outside of the streams, a place where you can just come, chill, chat, relax, and just ca catch up, you're welcome to join over there as well. Okay, monsoon run. Um, my baby. My main. My second. I play a, a class that I never play with, ever. Blue, do you ever play with Rex? Or the Acrid, sorry. It says the Discord link is in expired. That shouldn't be right. I specifically made it so that hmm. I specifically made it so that it had no. Uh, let me just copy this. Set link to never expire. Yeah. Copy. Okay, I'll throw it in chat right now. Still in a lot of people there, but every little bit helps. And obviously, if you can help grow the community as much as possible, reach out to friends, family, share it on social media. I would highly be appreciated. Uh, but coming back to the question, uh, do you ever play Acrid? I never play Acrid, ever. So I'm not sure what you posted there. Hmm. Yeah, I think it's changed now, so I'll just have to update that. If it ain't working, then I'm just going to have to put a, a link to it potentially somewhere else. I'll figure that out after the fact. But yeah, it's supposed to be permanent. Is it any good? I've never played Acrid. Ever. It's one of those classes that I never really do. So I think because I've never played Acrid before, I think I'm just going to go for normal difficulty, clean run, and see how she goes. Projectiles in close range. Mm. How well does the poison stack? 
does the poison is it um duplicated if you stack things like um gasoline or is it only based on your primaries but oh it doesn't stack with items mm. how good is the tick damage can you stack poison on itself if you hit an enemy multiple times so for example if i increase my attack speed can i hit people with poison relatively often so poison will have gasoline effect I want to try that out. I'm going to go with a normal run. Um, I'm doing this for science. I just want to see. So I'm going to take Artifact. I'm going to take Artifact Command and Accurate on a normal run. I just want to see what she does. Doggy. Okay, so mouse one is the swipe. Mouse two is the spit. What is the cooldown on that? Two, one. Okay, cooldown is relatively quick. Good shot on that. Mm, don't know how I feel about that. So let's... What normally affects cooldown? Hold on, let's grab this. Okay, I need something a bit more tankier to see how well it stacks. Yeah, that's a two-hit kill. Mm. I need something that's got a bit more life to it to be able to see if it stacks. You should have enough health. That's one. Nope. Okay, so no, it does not stack. Is there anything that I can do to make it stack? Hmm, that's concerning. see with ukulele if i hit somebody with ukulele will the poison transfer Damage is horrible though. That tick damage is really bad. Um, I'll increase my movement speed just for now. This is pure science. <laughs> Not going for a winning run yet. Okay, what is the what is the range of that? Spit Toxic Bile for 240% damage. Poison improvements when you level up. What is the infection range of it? Uh, let's go with this. Does the delicate watch does flat damage increase the poison damage, the tick damage? I'm trying to do base calculations here. So if I grab two of those, how are we looking? 
Okay, so I know flat damage is more because it went from 60 to 70. Yes, it does. Okay. So where it was ticking for 7, it's now ticking for uh, 10. Okay. And I'm still on level 3, so it wasn't the level that improved that. Ticking for 10. Okay, so ukulele doesn't spread it. Trying to see what to prioritize when you're running acrid. Or can also poison multiple enemies. Okay. Okay, so it's ticking 11. How long does it last? Oh, ukulele looks like it did spread that time. I do like the fact that it ticks for quite a bit. The splash on that just ain't great. Run, run. Okay. Don't. These wisps are going to be the death of me, so I think let's get them sorted out quickly. Okay, so now obviously the tick damage has become more. Mm, maybe. Hold on. The green stuff on the floor poisons the enemies when they stand on it. Okay, so that's from my shift. Got you. I'm going to enter the blue portal and I want to see. Can I get a massive damage in? Can I get a nice little buff in how much damage is done with the poison? Through one of these lovely babies. Uh, yes. Definitely grabbing that. Not what I actually wanted, but I'm going to take one of these. So I want to see what the damage is. Obviously half health. Uh, we're not going to sacrifice any helmet. I am ticking for 699 damage now. On poison. So I have gone from 7. Sorry, to third, from 13 damage. To almost 700 tick damage. Let's test it on something with a bit more oomph. With a bit more health that I can actually accurately see. Okay, so it's 27 out here. But it does not kill. Okay, so the damage increase was decent. The tick damage isn't bad. But I guess that also depends on the size of the target. Mm. Curiouser and curiouser. Okay, there's two chests right here. Come on, just spawn. Thank you. And four more gold.
grab another one of those. Okay, damage on that seems... You see, I'm trying to do as little from the rest of the stuff as possible. I'm trying to test solely the poison. How well you can make the poison work. What over here could be nice for the poison? The only thing I'm thinking for is that... And obviously, I don't want to stack bleed because I've already got... Does does the tick translate to bleed? Meaning every bleed damage that gets done can potentially proc... What's the proc coefficient on bleed? 32. That's not bad. But I have noticed they don't actually die from the bleed. Oh, they do. Having more of those is also kind of nice. Uh, let's grab some movement speed. So that thing's ticking away there, but it just doesn't tick over that last little bit of damage. Okay, so you can't actually kill somebody with bleed with um, poison alone. Interesting. That's interesting. Just get my ass some little bit of cover. That's really, really interesting though. So I can't kill somebody with the bleed because the bleed will run them all the way to the to their one health limit. So you've got to definitely rely on something else. Hmm. Uh, let's proc some more damage. Guillotine is good. Guillotine, I can imagine. Yeah, because you're taking everything down to that last little bit of health. Okay. Now, what number of guillotines is good? Do I only need one? It's 43 tick damage. So I'm ticking them down relatively easy. And I'm guessing they'll be dependent on health. Okay, let's try and get a hold of some green items. And let's find the portal. Yeah, like I said, this run is pure science. If we die, we die. I just don't play accurate enough to know if it's good or not. I'm trying not to hit them. I'm purposely trying to see why you're playing as Murloc. <laughs> I'm playing as a big puppy. I'm trying to find out how good this doggy actually is. Its primary focus is poison. So I'm trying to see without proccing bleed and fire and slow and all that kind of stuff. 
how well we can make just the poison work. There's also an acrid plushie. Makes sense. I can guarantee you there's some chick streamer out there that thinks this kid's the cutest doggy under the sun. Let's just stack another guillotine. I'm just trying to think what's going to be the best way to actually spread the poison. Okay, so you're stacking for 47. I need to see what guillotine does. Guillotine, do your job. Guillotine, do your job. Guillotine, do your job. Yeah, so guillotine has not worked on that enemy yet. Okay. And to try and stack some more guillotines. So suddenly we've got two, and it didn't do shit there. Yeah, and Maestro, this run is just for science. I'm probably going to die. I'm probably going to see my ass badly, but trying to test the theory here. Okay, so guillotine kicked in on that one. I mean, impact damage alone is pretty decent. If you can stack enough of those, that movement speed might be quite nice. Dude, that's the only thing I don't like. Fire kills. Poison does not. So you're going to be very dependent on guillotines if you're going to do this run. Hmm. I don't know how I feel about that. Okay. Stack the third guillotine. Okay, there's two big chests over here. Hopefully one of them is... See, I can't wait for guillotine to try and kick in there. I'm going to end up killing myself trying to figure that shit out. Uh, it's like getting some damage. Start trying to negate some damage. <coughs> some teddy bears mm, honestly not liking the damage output does ignition tank spread? I know it's going to be a long shot. It's probably not going to. Does ignition tank work and does damage or healing? Is there tick damage for every time I... Okay, so that doesn't work. Okay, so you don't tank, you don't get health from poison damage. Gertin only works on elites, that's true. So you don't get health from the tick damage of poison. It's only from direct attacks. Okay, so you don't get anything from that. Do the shuriken stack bleed by any chance? Sorry. 
Skull might be good. I've got a theory. Poison might be good to help get the health down, but as the mage, main damage dealer, definitely not the way you want to be going. Let's try the skull next time I get a green item. And that's the nice thing because now because we can select everything we want, we can see the effects that it's got. Poison is based on 1% of an enemy's max health. Is that a percentile number that we can increase somehow? Or is that a flat number that is stagnant? So that's going to do 54 ticks. So it's 54 per tick. The damage is not bad, but it doesn't last very long. Okay, so the shurikens are nice in that regard. Yeah, the more health it has, the more damage it does. Uh, Drag Pet, you follow me. Thank you very much for the follow. Really do appreciate it. Much love. Huh? I did not see the animation play. Or hasn't the animation played yet? I think what could potentially proc it as well. Animation played, but no sound. Ooh. Okay, I died. <laughs> one of us. One of us. I think I might have the sound on the alerts way too low. <laughs> yeah, F on that one. I don't know how I feel about Acrid, man. I honestly can't say that I'm a fan. Honestly, honest, honestly can't say that I'm a fan. I don't mind the bandit, and it's pretty decent. Sorry. I don't mind the bandit. It's okay. I absolutely hate multi. Engineer is king. We all know that. Artificer is kind of cool. Hate plasma bolt. Don't like the iron surge. Artificer is cool because you don't have to worry about attack speed at all. You don't have to worry about bleed either. If 
Void Fiend is just an absolute unit. An absolute fucking unit. And then Loader. I don't know what Loader is. I've never played as Loader, so... Let's try it out. There's some classes that just never drew my attention, so I was just never interested in it. Okay, that's a sweep. Wait. Hold up. Oh, that's nice. Okay. I need shurikens. Uh, that's going to be something to get used to. Okay, okay. Uh, get focus, crystal, and bands for him. I haven't unlocked the bands yet. I forgot how you unlock the bands. Oh, you have to fight those two special bosses. Yep, I haven't got the bands yet. Uh, get focus, crystals, and bands for him. Which is the focus crystals again? Is it a green item, white item? Crystal. I don't know what the crystal is. Diamond. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, because you're right in the person's face. That makes sense. I need cash. I'm doing pretty good things to yourself. Thank you very much for the follow. It means a lot. Keep it up. Good work. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. Okay, getting used to this character is going to be a while. How do I deal damage with this motherfucker from a distance? Uh, it's a gasoline. Because I'm trying to get something that I can actually get some kind of range out of this. I was trying to deal with these wisps.
Alright, I need some movement speed. Hmm. Question, that bubble that I throw down, does that thing continuously do damage? Or does it inherit, like the engineer, does it inherit the things that I've got? Okay, I know something that I need for this. You don't think so? Okay. I do know what I need for this though. I didn't know you could stand on top of this thing. <laughs> I did not know this was a strat that I could do. This is definitely an operator that I'm going to have to get used to. It feels very... I don't know how to describe it. It's fucking with me. I don't know what to think of this yet. I don't like the fact that it doesn't pull you towards it, it pulls you underneath it. I know that's more of how a grappling hook works, but like, I don't like it. That's going to be good because I can at least grapple more than once. Mm, am I a fan? Am I not a fan? I think this is going to be one of those, those operators that I can't judge it off of just one run. This is going to have to be one of those ones. Try and get good with it and see how it goes.
I guess that hits for quite a bit. See, like, how do I do damage to that guy now if I can't fucking reach him? It's weird. It's like I have to wait for everything to come to me. The problem is some things will not. And that thing just fucked up my entire charge. Mm, what did you say to also get? Uh, just get all the crystals. I want this. Know if I like this, I honestly don't know if I like this. having something to get a bit of distance with the projectiles is nice. This one's going to need some practice. Okay, that was cool. Oh, don't get me killed, pretty please. Damage is disgusting me bad. Okay, let's try and get some more of those crystals. Doesn't Lotus damage also come from how much momentum you do? Hold up, I actually think that's a thing.
Come on, stop taking my money. God, if I'm liking Lodo or not. I'm trying to watch the impact numbers versus when I'm coming in with a passion or whether I'm just swinging normal. 206. Actually, did more damage. No idea where this teleporter actually is. Uh, I see the particles. Okay, it was probably underneath. Yeah, it's inside. Okay, not a fan. Absolutely not a fan of Loader.
Focusing so much harder on this guy than I have on any one of them before. The other playstyles are normally a lot easier, a lot more chilled. And I lost the watch. Mm. I'm gonna test this out. I need the hits to do as much damage as they possibly can. Okay, Hopu Feathers help a lot in making me actually somewhat be able to hit the target. So I need one or two more Hopu Feathers. You see, this class just relies too much on very specific skills to make it good. That would be nice. Damage is abysmal. That's me dead. Yep. Don't like it. Do not like loader at all. Not my playstyle. Not the way I like it at all. I gave it a fair option. It's one of the main reasons why I hated mercenary. I don't like the 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 melee style of fighting. Not in the slightest. Okay. So we had one god run, which is absolutely amazing, but that is 100% down to the pearl that we found. And then the two runs after that with... Um, 
Oh, was it the mon the the monsoon run with rail gunner and then the Rex run and now the loader? Kind of fails. Rex, sorry, accurate. I keep calling it Rex. That's Rex. That's accurate. Accurate was more of a test. We wanted to see what we can stack bleed with, what we can't stack bleed with. So it's more so a test to see how things went. But I think that's it for this evening. Thank you very much to everybody that joined the stream. It really does mean a lot. The engagement tonight was pretty badass the amount of viewers that we've had has been pretty pretty nice and thank you again so much to drag to blue basher to alienist and then flavor dave as well the four most recent followers all within the last six days thank you so much for the love and support i am going to obviously ask that you guys reach out on all social media platforms that you've got friends family discords groups that you're part of try and spread the word for the channel as much as you possibly can maestro thank you very much for always being here love you lots man Everybody else, look after yourselves. Have a lovely evening and or day, depending on where you're from. Look after yourselves, be yourselves, and I'll see you tomorrow or in the next one.